Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna review your personal foundation kit from La Manufacture. If you don't know what it is, it's a complete kit to find and produce your own personalized foundation. So it's really, really helpful uh, if you're in between shades, if you can't ever find your shades, um, if you're slightly transitioning shades because um, you're transitioning seasons as well and you may be more or less tanned. Or if you're a makeup party and you don't wanna have a thousand foundations, heavy foundation bottles on the go with you. Now, full disclosure, even though I wasn't sent this foundation in PR and for reviewing purposes, I was gifted it from a colleague of mine who used to work for La Manufacture. Um, but everything I say in this review is 100% my honest opinion. Before we begin, please subscribe to my channel. It would mean the world to me. If you wanna see how I made my shade of foundation and how to use this kit, then please keep on watching. In the kit, you will find the instruction manual, the five shades, and a spatula, a glass container, and a skin cam that you attach to your phone in this way. Follow the instruction carefully to attach it. You um, activate flash, scan the QR code, and go to this link right here. The website allows you to take photos and have your personal foundation recipe. You just tap in your name and either you create an account or go on as guest, a feature that I really appreciate it. After that, you will see a tutorial on how to fix a skin cam and take three photos. The skin cam will be able to detect the right mix of the five shades you need to create your own personal foundation. After taking my photo, I use a pot and a syringe in the kit. Your recipe will tell you how much to fill the syringe with every shade. For example, it told me to get to 1.8 in the syringe with shade 1. You have to discharge a dozen syringe in the pot and clean the syringe between every usage. And basically, there you are. You play chemistry lab with your foundation. It's pretty fun. This foundation is a little bit on the drier side when they say oil-free it really is oil-free and what I like to do about it is then mix it in with a couple of drops of oil in this case it's 100% uh, plant-derived school lane so that my skin tolerates it better because you know otherwise it will tend to strip and um, that's all I want to do oh oh Okay, not bad. Um, I didn't think it's bad, you guys. What do you think? I mean, I still feel like it's a little bit more on the neutral side uh, for me. I still feel like um, my neck and my decollete are a little bit um, more yellow or olive tone. Um, and what you need to know is also that the camera gave me a result and I thought I swatched it on my hand and I thought it was a little bit too pink for me. And I added in another 0.2 um, drops of um, yellow of the fifth shade. Though not 100% perfect with some skins. And um, yeah, I hope they take this review into consideration. And um, overall though, I find it I did a pretty good match, to be honest. Yeah. So there are many hours of sun left, so I'm just gonna 
finish my makeup and tell you guys what I think about it. So all in all, this is a good product for makeup artists who are always on the go and don't want to have a thousand foundations. Um, and also, it's really helpful for people who um, struggle with finding their foundation shades. And also, it's very useful, I find, when you're transitioning in season, so you're more or less tan. This will be very, very useful for people with oily skin because it's a true matte foundation. As you can see, I had to mix in some uh, drops of oil. Uh, it's very long lasting. It's true that it's, it has a very silky texture, as you can see. And yeah, I hope you liked this review and it was useful for you. Uh, if you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And as per usual, stay safe and stay beautiful. Ciao! Thank you.